A few East Valley beauty salons hit by overnight break-ins. They happened just a few weeks apart, and now the owners are wondering if they might be connected. Fox 10's Danielle Miller joins us live in Mesa with more tonight. John, good evening. Yes, this first break in happened right here in Mesa at this business. You can see the door still boarded up from being smashed in. The other break in happened in Gilbert, not too far away from this business. Now, I spoke with both of the owners today. They were telling me that they believe their industry, which is the beauty industry, is being targeted. They want to warn other owners of the potential dangers. I never thought that in Gilbert, Arizona, my business that is so open and in this strip would be targeted. Unfortunately, that's exactly what happened to owner of the Wildflower Beauty Bar, Kendra Harris. During the early morning hours on Monday, someone broke into the Gilbert location here on Higley in Guadalupe in Gilbert. Harris says once the person was unable to get in through the back door, they broke the lockbox and made their way in. And then as soon as they came in the back door, they saw that we had cameras cameras um, and they immediately ripped the um, equipment off of the wall and unplugged everything so that nothing would be recorded. Whoever did this stole a few things like nail polish and a micro needling pen. They also stole all of the cash. They ripped it off and then they actually opened it. So they had like tools with them to pry the cash register open and then took all the cash that was inside of it. Just a few weeks before this, you see this person captured on surveillance video breaking into Nia Skin in Mesa. Also happening overnight, owner Michelle Lujan says they made a few changes since this happened. We broke the glass door, came in and proceeded to our cash register, took out the cash, walked around towards our back area, went and checked the two rooms in the bathroom. Both owners believe their industry is being targeted. I believe because we are women ran businesses, we are most vulnerable or they think we're vulnerable. And sadly, uh, overnight, a hair salon owner just in this exact area of this Mesa location also posting on social media that her salon was also broken into and vandalized. Now, we did speak with the police departments in both of these instances, and they were telling us that uh, both of these cases are under investigation. They also want to remind uh, these business owners that I spoke with today to make sure you have your security cameras in place and everything just to be prepared, uh, unfortunately, if something like this were to happen. Reporting live, Danielle Miller, Fox 10 News.